whether it is in leadership role if there are three departments and three of you are handling yours must be doing the best amongst the three departments your project must be finishing way before deadline compared to any other project and this has got nothing to do with how others do you are slowly programming yourself to relive the inheritance of the sperm that you were you were the number one sperm don't forget it your basic inheritance is to be the number one you were sent here to be number one you're not an ulcer and if you are the number two sperm you would have never come because you were the number one sperm you could win and you came into existence and we got to live up to this inheritance let it take time i i am not naive enough to tell you that right now from a position which you are holding 54th you can move into number 1 in no matters of time but it can happen over a bit let it take time let's not die till we complete it whatever time it takes refuse to die as the number 2 in whatever you are doing in fact make a collaboration with your god sign this memorandum I will not come till I become number one in what I do. How much ever time it takes. So if you want, you finish it fast for me. <laughs> and look at the potential. It's not about what others can do. Look at the potential. It's not without a reason you were created as Prem Sachitan. Live up to it. Bring in that initiatives. Take more initiatives in the organization than anybody else has done. But I keep telling my people whenever they say I want to play at least a squirrel's part. How long will you keep saying squirrel's part? Say in my team, I want to play the Hanuman role, biggest role. Why squirrel role, squirrel role? How long squirrel role? You know, every time somebody in the organization come and say, I want to play my small part in your dreams. I said, Po, miscellaneous column, etc. I want to listen to people who can come and say, I want to play the biggest role. in the dream that you want to fulfill i want to take the biggest responsibility i remember i'll never forget that moment batch 3 was over and we were going to have the first convention batch 3 was over on december 23 1995 and april 14th 1996 we are going to have the first convention and one of them who was one among the entire batch mates came up to me and said i heard we are going to have a convention few months from now i said yes i hardly knew him he's just done the course and you know what he said whatever is the biggest responsibility in the convention please give it to me and i have seen the way that person had grown in life because his mind was prepared if there is something called biggest responsibility then i should be shouldering it nobody else should be shouldering it and that is the attitude in fact i am looking for a few of you in your corporate the general manager sitting here the vice president sitting here walking up to your chairman and saying hand me over the biggest department in the organization give me what is the biggest responsibility in fact ask yourself in whatever industry you are operating can i create the biggest revolution my industry has operated 